State Health is voluntarily pausing its liver transplant program. Ireland Viscount joins us live with more Ireland. Valerie, this decision is so the center can undergo a performance review with representatives from the United Network for Organ Sharing. In an emailed written statement, a spokesperson with Penn State Health says the decision to inactivate comes after concerns about clinical processes and documentation were identified. Penn State Health has individually notified 63 patients on the waiting list or undergoing evaluation for the wait list regarding the program's pause and are working with other liver transplant centers to facilitate a transition of their care, adding they will continue to provide post transplant care for patients who have already received a transplant at Penn State Health since reactivating its liver transplant program about a year ago. Penn State Health says it's been routinely submitting clinical performance data and other information to the United Network for Organ Sharing to monitor the program's progress. The health system will continue to work with the United Network for Organ Sharing to ensure that its liver transplant program meets patients' needs as effectively and safely as possible. The voluntary pa pause of the liver transplant program does not affect other Penn State health transplant programs. The kidney, heart, stem cell, and bone marrow transplant programs will operate as usual. Now in April 2022, Penn State Health voluntarily inactivated its abdominal transplant program, which includes kidney and liver transplants in order to make improvements and later announced the reactivation of that program in March 2023. Valerie. Thank you, Ireland.